Well, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. And thank you very much for coming out to our 12th annual Medina County Weights and Measures Seals Design Contest. I'm Medina County Auditor Mike Kovac, and it's my extreme pleasure to be with you today to recognize some uh, very talented uh, students from across Medina County. Before we begin today, I wanted to thank uh, Superintendent Michael Larson and Principal Stephen Christman of the Medina County Career Center for hosting us once again this year. I do. <laughs> uh, we also certainly appreciate the efforts of uh, Chris Kurth for coordinating the awards ceremony and also for Chef Can uh, Tony Stanislow and his restaurant management class, not only for providing the refreshments, but for allowing us the use of their dining room uh, and handling the setup for the event. I also want to thank the uh, teachers who assist their students in uh, entering the contest. Although any Medina County High School student can enter, uh, these teachers typically make this uh, part of their teaching tool and we certainly appreciate their efforts. I want to th send thanks out to uh, Sherry Hoover and Ron Kostacek of the Career Center, Sean Van Dyke. Oh, you can applaud for them. You guys are, it's the home school here. <laughs> Puts the pressure on the rest of you as uh, 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 Sean Van Dyke and Larry Kaufman of Wadsworth High School. <laughs> Molly Jarvis of Cloverleaf High School and Shelley Baltic of Black River High School. Let's give them a round of applause too. I'd also like to recognize we have Assistant Principal Taringo up from Wadsworth High School, so thank you for coming up today. And for the first time this year, we had the assistance of professional graphic artists in helping us do the judging this year. And so I want to thank Cindy Allman and Ron Bell of the Medina County Arts Council uh, for lending us their professional expertise. <laughs> this is an applauding kind of crowd. That's a... And finally, I'd like to recognize my Chief Deputy Auditor, Joan Heller, and um, uh, also our Chief Weights and Measures Inspector, Sean Bland, and uh, Deputy Auditor, Brittany Schmid Schmigel, <coughs> who has taken over uh, all of our preparation from the auditor's side for the ceremony this time of year. Let's give them a nice round of applause. I'd also be remiss if I didn't thank all of our students who entered the contest this year. We typically have a, a couple hundred entries that come in, and so the competition for these uh, awards is pretty stiff. And every year, then, then we get these designs, and we're tremendously impressed with the talents of the students in Medina County. And so thank all, thank you, thanks to all of you who do enter this contest. And for many of you here today, these seals are just about a contest, but in reality, these seals are only the most visible part of a program that goes on every day in Medina County to make sure that there truly is equity in the marketplace. Before your award-winning seals go on the more than 4,000 devices in the county, my Chief Inspector Sean Bland, with the assistance of Phil Horsberger, ensure that each device is working properly. Gasoline, groceries, car washes, tanning beds, farm feed, the weight of trucks passing through on our roads. All of these items and many more are checked annually and rechecked throughout the year to ensure that people buy with confidence not only in Medina County but throughout the state. Your seals are important in that they let people know that the goods that they are buying have been inspected for accuracy. Thank you to each and every one of you for helping us in this program. The Medina County's Auditor's Office is mandated by law to have two different seals in our Weights and Measures program. One is in the category of price verification. These seals are used in checking the UPC scanners at store checkouts to ensure you're paying at the checkout what is actually advertised on the shelf. The second seal we use gives notice that a mechanical device that weighs or dispenses any product has been inspected and sealed. Those are the words in the Ohio Revised Code. What this means is that every commercial measuring device in the county, most noticeably the gas pumps, are tested. Sean and his staff then actually put a lead seal. They, they secure the device with a lead seal to ensure that they aren't tampered with once the inspection occurs. Then the sticker or seal that we visibly put on these devices lets people know that they have been checked. And those stickers that we use for that purpose have been designed by our 12 student finalists in the room with us today. And with that, we're now ready to recognize our 2012 Medina County Seals Award winners. And we're going to start in the inspected and sealed category. And in the inspected and sealed category, 
And we're going to call your name, then we're going to play your video if one is here. Um, and then when that finishes up, we'll, we'll bring you up front. And in sixth place in the inspected and sealed category is Mark Christie from the Medina County Career Center. I'm Mark Christie. I'm from Medina County Career Center. My teacher is Mrs. Hoover and I'm in the 11th grade. I um, got my idea for the seal. Now I'm trying to make it like a government official looking thing uh, with the red, white, and blue and the eagle. Um, what I like most about my class is I get complete creative freedom as opposed to other classes I've had where not really much. Mark Christie. Up here, we're going to put you in the middle. Everyone else has to watch how this goes. Sean, he'll give you that. We've got uh, we've got Mark's seal actually here. We'll have you hold that. And we also have some of the actual seals that we're going to use to give you here. So uh, we're going to get this picture taken here for you. <laughs> and congratulations. <clears throat> there you go, Mark Christie, ladies and gentlemen. And in fifth place from Wadsworth High School, Jack Pecknick. Hi, my name is Jack Pecknick. I am a junior at Wadsworth High School. Um, I created the seal in Mrs. Van Dyke's advanced word processing class. Um, I got the idea for the seal kind of on the spot. I used two shades of blue to kind of make the seal flow together. Um, in advanced word processing, we do anything from making restaurant menus to writing letters to people in nursing homes. Um, I really liked the class and I liked Mrs. Van Dyke and I would recommend it for underclassmen to take it. Jack Pecknick from Wadsworth. <laughs> Come around here, we get you in the middle. Have to smile for your principal over there. <laughs> <laughs> Very demanding. I work with it. <clears throat> and these are your seals for you. Thank you. Jack Pecknick from Wadsworth, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> and that's always interesting. As he pointed out, that's a word processing class. So his design uh, that he did today, and actually, hopefully you guys were able to see it. I guess we should hold those up a little bit more. Um, that is all done on word processing by some of the other uh, systems that uh, folks in the graphic designs classes classes are using, so congratulations. In fourth place in the inspected is sealed, although not able to be with us today, is Kelly Jenkins from Cloverleaf High School. And actually, I believe uh, Kelly has graduated early. Oh. But Kelly is not here today, and she's in fourth place. Okay. All right, I think so. Is that perhaps Amanda up there? Okay. In third place in the inspected and sealed category from Cloverleaf High School is Amanda Hammond. Oh. Hi, I'm Amanda Hammond. I go to Cloverleaf High School and I'm a junior. Uh, tell me a little bit about the design for your seal. Um, I went with the governmental theme and went with the red, white, and blue because of our United States and the color of our flag. <laughs> um, How'd you get the idea for your seal? Um, I just took it as the stars and I morphed them into something that looked cool and different and it went more of a simple theme. All right, and what have you designed most or enjoyed most about your design class? Um, it's a lot different than regular art classes. I mean, you're working on the computer more. It's not as hands-on, but it's a different way of working with art. And what are your plans after high school? I'd like to be an RN and work at the Cleveland Clinic or somewhere big. But, uh, <clears throat> Amanda Hammond from Cloverleaf High School. Oh, that's wrong one. No, this is the next one. But, uh, congratulations. Thank you. Get you over here. Get your seal. From Sean. All right. And here you go, here are your seals. You. <clears throat> Amanda Hammond. Uh, 
And in second place from the Medina County Career Center, Paige Farrow. <laughs> Hi, my name is Paige Farrow. I am in 12th grade at the Medina County Career Center. My design teacher is Mrs. Hoover. Um, for my design, I went for simple and my colors represent Medina County. What I've enjoyed most about my design class is working on yearbook with my best friend, Brooke Kaler. Paige Farrow. <laughs> John, here you go. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. That's, That's my it. BFF, Brooke Kaler. All right, there you go. Get that right, boy. Do I hold this with you? You can, yes. Okay. You want to look at the lady with the camera. She's, she's very demanding. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah. Paige Farrow, ladies and gentlemen. And in first place in our inspected and sealed category from Medina County Career Center, Drew Schneider. Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. My name is Drew Schneider. I'm a senior at the Medina County Career Center. My design teacher is Mrs. Hoover. Now, with my design, I went for a simplistic kind of look. It came to me in a dream one night to have something better than just a simple auditor design. What have I enjoyed most about this class? I've enjoyed the fact that I'm around people that like to design and we come together as a family and discuss ideas and make out overall great products. <laughs> <laughs> Drew Schneider! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Congratulations, come on up here. Oh, look at you, see you got that. <clears throat> I have to look at this lady over here, that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. We got your, your seals here too. too. Congratulations. <laughs> Drew Schneider, who will be hosting this event next year. That's true. <laughs> and now we move to the price verification category. <clears throat> In sixth place for the price verification category from Wadsworth High School, Joshua Schnick. <laughs> you guys are the Wadsworth, you guys need to leave. Hi, my name is Joshua Schnick. I'm a junior at Wadsworth High School. I took website design with Mr. Coffin. And uh, it, Mr. Coffin kind of told me just to go big. And so I took the idea of using the high school colors, red, white, and black. Just threw them together and made a pretty cool sign sticker deal. <laughs> Joshua Schnick, come on up. <laughs> Congratulations. Getting a lot of help from your friends over there. <laughs> it's required. <laughs> Congratulations, Joshua. You get this for you. We also get your seals for you. All right. Joshua Schnick, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> In fifth place from Black River High School, Emily Marino. Come on up, Emily. Uh, congratulations. Okay, I had you hold that. And Emily has the misfortune of not having a video, so she gets to tell us a little bit about her seal. <laughs> do you want me to do it now? Yes, yes. Okay, well, um, I went for a simple but patriotic look for my seal. Um, my teacher's Miss Baltic, and I took the class because I thought it would be fun and creative, which it is. She makes it really fun. <laughs> Um, and are you a senior or a junior? I'm a sophomore, actually. A sophomore. That's our first sophomore winner. Well, congratulations, um, Emily Marino. Thank you. There you go. That's it. Oh, we got to get the picture. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> and here's your seat. Yeah. Mm. Emily Marino, ladies and gentlemen. In fourth place, 
I keep laughing because I just want to say it's just like the Grammys last night. Yes, I know. Um, it's just like the Grammys last night. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> we need to bring Drew back up. Uh, in fourth place in the price verification category from the Medina County Career Center, Sydney Miller. <clears throat> Just like the Grammys last night. My name is Sydney Miller. I'm from the Benida County Career Center. Um, my teacher is Miss Hoover. I'm in 11th grade. My design, I used a sunset and made it bright and colorful. I got my idea from using the license plates and made a sunset and used farms in the background. And I enjoyed most about my design class is being creative and getting to think outside the box. Sydney Miller, ladies and gentlemen. Congratulations. And you're over here. Mom, get it? All right, yeah. here we go. And we have your seals here. <clears throat> Congratulations, Sydney Miller from the Career Center. In third place in the price verification category is Matt Horner from Wadsworth High School. Hi, my name is Matt Horner. I'm a senior at Wadsworth High School. And I was in website design and I created this Medina County Auditor sticker. My inspiration from, for my design came from the Ohio flag and what the, uh, the Ohio colors have. And um, I put the, the great seal of the state of Ohio in there. And uh, I got everything that I needed to know about website design from Mr. Kaufman. So I'd like to thank him for his help in helping me with my design. Matt Horner from Wadsworth High School. Congratulations. Thank you. We have to move up out of the... Uh, It's still? <laughs> we'll take them afterwards. That's all right. Yeah. <laughs> Here you go. Right. <laughs> Matt Horner from Wadsworth High School. <laughs> in second place in the price verification category from Wadsworth High School, Noah Lisbon. My name's Noah. I go to Wadsworth High School. I'm in 10th grade. Mr. Kaufman's my teacher. I came about this design. I looked on Google for an outline of Ohio, and then I took the Ohio flag and put it in the outline and put some color on the words, and that's about it. <laughs> Noah Lisbon, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Nice design. Congratulations. I have stuff on my face. <laughs> there you go. We got these for you. That. Noah Lisbon from Wadsworth High School. <clears throat> And in first place in the price verification category, again from Wadsworth High School, Louis Messam. Hi, my name is Louis Messam. I'm an 11th grader at Wadsworth High School. And my website design teacher is Mr. Kaufman. Um, a little bit about my design is I have it, the Ohio State colors and the Buckeye, which I think represents Ohio well. And my inspiration for this was based on my love for the, uh, the Ohio State University and 
Mr. Kaufman helping me out with everything. Louis Messam from Wadsworth High School. Congratulations. Thank you. You don't have your scarlet and gray on today. No. <laughs> there you go. And we got your seals for you here, too. Congratulations. Sir. Louis Messam from Wadsworth High School. Mm. Once again, congratulations to all of our winners here today and also to all of our students who, uh, who did graphic design work for the contest. Again, we, uh, the graphic artists, the professional graphic artists who are in to judge the work were tremendously impressed with the work that you guys do. So you should be very proud uh, with what you're learning out there at your different schools from your teachers. Let's give all the students another round of applause, please. Once again, I want to thank uh, Principal Chrisman from the uh, Career Center, Chris Kurth and Tony Stanislow of the Medina County Career Center for their hospitality and hosting this event. Um, they've got the one from the heart, I think their fundraiser here for the Career Center coming up this Saturday. Uh, they do an outstanding job. If you ever need uh, catering services, they do a great job at a very reasonable price. Thank you again to our teachers, Molly Jarvis of Cloverleaf, Shelley Baltic of Black River, Sherry Hoover and Ron Kostacek of the Career Center, Larry Kaufman and Sean Van Dyke of Wadsworth. And again, once, of, uh, once again, thank you most of all to all of our students who entered the contest just this year. Uh, again, outstanding design work. I think this really was the, uh, the best year that we've had for the design, some really excellent ones uh, that we got in. Uh, and again, all that talent uh, in the county is going to be on display um, all throughout Medina County going up in the next week and throughout the year. So congratulations to all of you. Thanks for coming out. Uh, I am Medina County Auditor Mike Kovac. I want to thank you for attending the 2012 SEALS Awards Ceremony. Thanks. <laughs>